our fans in the audience when people <laughs> react like that. <laughs> One more time, we want to say a huge thank you. We're called Ida May, and uh, our first album came out six months ago. And we want to say a huge thank you again to Rodrigo and Gabriela for having us out. You're going to have an incredible show. Please come, come and say hi at the merch because we want to come back as soon as we can and play our own show when everyone is healthy. <laughs> I'm just going to introduce this guitar because I feel we definitely have guitar music fans here this evening. Real music fans. So, these guitars are resonators. These were designed in the 1920s. Uh, these, these work on gramophone technology. The strings vibrate into a small piece of wood, which goes into an aluminium speaker cone to make noise. So this is before the electric guitar amp or the electric guitar. The idea is, of these guitars is you will be loud. You will be as loud as the clarinet and the brass players in your jazz band. You would be louder than the freaking banjo player. <laughs> <laughs> and they were used by a lot of blues musicians, I think, because they can withstand all the humidity and temperature, temperatures you guys have here. And also, they're pretty good as weapons, if you've learned this. <laughs> and they were also designed during the Hawaiian music craze. So you can see, I've got palm trees and volcanoes. <laughs> So not only is this a resonator, so it's supposed to be the loudest guitar, it also has 12 strings. And they invented 12 string guitars to be louder than anything else. So you combine the two, and this guitar is the equivalent of ACDC in 1928. <laughs> uh, so we're going to have a little blues song. Thank you so much for having us.